WFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update and a bit of a mixed bag. Just like yesterday, that mix coming from the Dow and the Dow Transports. The Dow is up 152, about a half a percent. Three tenths for the trannies are up about 49. The S&P is off four, three right now. Uh, NDX is down 31. Russell is off 10 points. It's about a half percent move to the downside. The uh, semis there trading uh, off about 1%, 29 points. Gold is off 2 bucks. Silver, 22 pennies to the downside. Light tree crude is up 48 cents. Natural gas taking a little bit of a breather. It's down 3 pennies. 30 year treasury is down 1 point and 1 tick. Trading out at 122.05. Let's try to figure out what all that means by taking a look at that nine panel market update chart. You begin with the ES Mini. The ES Mini today is going to form bar number nine of a TD nine count pattern. That suggests that the low should form today or tomorrow with a bounce up into its oscillator and change line. I don't have that on this uh, uh, sheet here, but we'll take a look at that most certainly during the Trader's Edge show. If we take a look at spot volatility right now, it's positioned in favor of the bulls for the S&P 500. Why? Because price is below its 50-day exponential moving average. The 50-day is at 2078. Price right now trading out at 2043. If we take a look at the NQ, it too is going to form a TD nine count bottom pattern today well of course it depends on its close but right now that's the position that it's in it still has to form bar number nine out there we'll take a look at those details during the traders edge show but that is suggesting a move higher as well the nq would target around the 12 275 area the u.s dollar index is traded above the top of its daily profile the top of that profile 104.82 if it closes above that today that's suggesting a move up toward test that td9 count breakdown uh, level or the TDI threshold level, I should say, at 105.32. You close above that, the dollar's headed to the moon. Goldilocks has a nice TD9 count bottom pattern with price consolidating with inside its daily profile. Uh, resistance up at 18.56. Silver formed a new profile yesterday. It is bullish in structure. Your support level, don't have any kind of a bottom pattern, but price is above that 2083 level. And another close above that is suggesting to you and I that silver wants to make a run to 2213. I just wish we had a nice bottoming pattern out there. If we take a look at late speed crude, just consolidate with inside its daily profile. That range between 7440 as support and 79 and a quarter, 79.24 for resistance. Natural gas, even though it's pointing back just a tad, strong like bull. If you take a look at the last four or five trading sessions, on every pullback, it's not even come close. Maybe one day it came close to testing the prior low out there. Price is above the top of its bullish structure daily profile. That suggests it wants higher price. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader Said Show if you want, but if you have to start your Thursday,